everybody, Gina DeLuca here. All right, today I'm gonna to be trying something a little different. I was at the Walmart and found this dustpan, uh, came with a brush, um, but I don't need the brush at the moment. But the dustpan has no lip and all of the dustpans that I've tried this with had a lip and it really just didn't work. So. We're gonna give it a whirl. Gonna be doing like a ribbon pour with the dustpan. Colors I'm using today. I picked uh, three colors from the top row here, the three in the middle, and I added black. So that's dioxazine purple mixed with white, uh, Liquitex Basics. This is Thalo Blue and Thalo Green and White from Basics. This is Old Gold by Artist Loft and some of the Deco Art Metallics in 24 karat gold. These paints are mixed one part paint to two parts Floetrol and Thinned to the proper consistency with my concoction of 10% Floetrol to 90% water. The consistency that we're working with, you can see it does make a mound, but it disappears pretty quickly. My black, I have mixed just a hair thinner, a hair, barely any, just a hair. Uh, if you're wondering what that card was, this card, it is from my Fluid Art Inspiration Card set. There are eight cards with color palettes, all different palettes, and 42 cards with different techniques along with color palettes. And even these boxes can be used for a two color pour. They are designed to be complimentary. So there you have it. They are available at my website, ginadeluca.net. If you are international and you have problems placing an order, some folks have, particularly from Australia, um, just email me at uh, Gina Deluca Art at gmail.com and we will get you set up. I'm gonna put down a base coat. I'll be using black for that. You definitely want to lay down a base coat because you want to make sure that your paints have something to slide around on. Time to put some paint in a cup. This gold may or may not sell. We'll see. There's no silicone in any of these paints. I'm gonna start with a bit of black. Just a bit. Basically just enough to cover the bottom of the cup.
All right, I have about four ounces in this cup, should be more than enough. I'm going to add some black. I'm gonna do something crazy here. I just wanna give this a bit of a base coat as well. So the paint slides around. What could go wrong when you have last minute uh, changes? Nothing, nothing could go wrong. Okay, it looks like we're gonna be doing a dustpan waterfall here. That gold looks pretty. I'm going to take this pan and I have a sheet protector over yonder and I'm gonna let it run off onto that I will show you that later okay I'm gonna let this sit and then I'll bring you in for a close-up okay here it is this came out really pretty the gold the shimmer in the gold is just beautiful and it made some gorgeous metallic greens, uh, very pretty purple with the gold sitting right on top. So from one angle, you can't see the gold at all. It just looks like purple. But from the right angle, look at that flash. camera just does not do it justice. Got the interesting folds going there from the wiggle. Yeah. I like this piece actually. I think the colors came out great. Just very pretty. I bet those metallics are gonna be spectacular once they are dried and then varnished. 
Yes, yes, yes. Well, I hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned something. I did. Please like and share and subscribe and all that good stuff. If you found this video useful, other people might as well. Sharing is caring. Do check out the description box below for links to my website, GinaDeLuca.net, where you can find my fluid art inspiration cards. Oh, here's the, uh, the skin that I made. You can see I just took what was left on the pan and just ran it down a sheet protector and I will be able to make some pretty necklaces out of that. Little bonus. Also in the description box, you will find my PayPal tip jar if you feel so inclined and would like to help me stay stocked up in paints to keep bringing you groovy experiments. And my Amazon link, most of the items that you see me use you can find in my Amazon store, but if it's not there, fret not. Anything that you purchase off the entire site of Amazon, I will receive a small commission of at no additional cost to you if you use that link. Also in the description box, go make some art. Join our Facebook group, Post Your Masterpieces, Ask Your Questions, Get some inspiration. Also, do check out my music video. It should be popping up at the end of this one, but the link is also in the description box for the song Better Than Chocolate. It was my first music video. It just came out a few months ago, so I'm still very excited about that. Okay, that is it for me for today. I hope y'all have a beautiful day. Now go make some art.